Good morning. I decided to do a vlog today because I haven't done one in a long time and just thought that I would take you guys throughout my day. And it's 6.30 in the morning and I've been up for an hour and a half and I'm about to make my second cup of coffee. Um, I have been using this coffee that we got from Sam's Club in New Mexico. It's my favorite. Pinon. And it's really good. It's, um, it just has kind of like a, like a rich, it reminds me of almost like, um, like a hazelnut type flavor, but it's, uh, pine nuts, but in the coffee it just tastes really good. So, I'm going to make that, and, um, yeah, I think, I'm not really sure what we're going to be doing today. We don't have the car today. Because Garrett's motorcycle headlights went out, of course, and so he took the car to work. And um, so I'll be walking Chris to school, and um, yeah, so we, we won't be able to go to the park, I don't think. But there's a park that's kind of along the way, but it's just not shaded, so it depends on how hot it'll be at like 2 o'clock. Um, if we go to that park or not, but I'm gonna make my coffee. I got this new mug from Yosemite and it was pretty freaking expensive. It was like $23 for this little basic mug, but this is how I make my coffee. I just fill it about that much. Add a shit ton of sugar. <laughs> and I like a lot of cream inside of it. So um, I just use this organic clover half and half that we get from Costco. Just put that much. And that's it. Just putting a new game in here. Let's see. We just got this, so we don't have very many games, but he wanted to play. Super Mario Odyssey. So I'm going to put that in here. This is just the light. I did not feel comfortable getting a six year old. The, um, the regular one. So I just got him the light one. Here you go, Chris. Moana. You say Moana? 
so we normally eat breakfast around like 7 30 so um i got this quiche from costco came in a two pack this one's like the cheddar broccoli and i totally threw away the packaging just to make it easier to put in the fridge so i think i'm just gonna put this at like 375 to preheat and it should be heated through I mean, within a half hour, I think even before then. And then at 6.45 right now, and then we'll be able to eat breakfast on time. But this looked really good. So it came with this one, and then it also came with uh, spinach, asparagus or something like that. I don't even remember what it was, but cheddar broccoli is where it's at. this basil plant from Trader Joe's and it's lasted like two months. It's inside of a little Easter thing that um, Christopher made but I just add just a little bit of water every day. Just like I don't know like a fourth of a cup and it does pretty good but it's been nice having fresh basil although it's starting to die off a little bit more i just i pull so much off of it that there's just a lot of like baby leaves now maybe i should give it some time to like regrow a little but i also try to take like like these kind of leaves i'm pretty sure that that's um like a type of like mold or something and i think you're supposed to just take all those off so it doesn't spread but Otherwise, I mean, I've been happy with it. It's really good basil, too. Okay, so this is done now. Looks really good. Heat it through. It took, like, let's see, 722 right now because I had to preheat the oven before I put it in. I just gave the kids some strawberries with theirs and some pineapple juice. Pineapple juice. Yeah. It's good. It's good, huh? And then I had a banana with mine because I don't like cold strawberries. So I washed a bunch and I'll probably eat some strawberries later. Okay, so I'm going to taste this because I've never had store-bought quiche before. But I was craving it and I didn't want to make it. It's okay. It's a little bland compared to the quiche I made. I think I add a lot of cheese though, so this is good though. It's good as an easy meal. And then this is my favorite pineapple juice. It's um, the Landers pineapple juice. It's yours too. Yeah, it's, it's really good pineapple juice. Is that good? He eats like everything. Yep, me too. I like. Esme's been on a food strike. He does that whenever he thinks someone's taking a picture of him. Say cheese. <laughs> Take a picture of me. All right.
Don't choke on that, please. That was a really big bite, dude. Take a bite from me. Take a bite. There's cheese in it. There's a big bite. Okay. Let's see. It's good, huh? I like it. Chew with your mouth closed, babe. Are you all done? He stole part of my banana. He ate all of his strawberries and ate like half of his quiche. Was it good? Was it good? Yeah. Are you full? That's Esme's juice. He really likes open cups, but when I give him open cups, he puts all of his food inside of it and then drinks it and then eats it and makes a big mess out of it. And I really didn't want to make a big mess right now, so I just gave him a sippy cup. All right, I'm gonna wipe you off now, okay? From Mario's Fairy, like the cat one, the Mario cat, Super Mario cat. And also a lot of color right here. What? A lot of color right here. A curl right there? Yeah. To, to make it cool. Um, we don't have very good gel, babe. How about I get some better gel and then I could do stuff like that. Oh, oh, oh yeah, that is gel. No, that one's not very good either. What? We need a gel that like has daddy? a stronger hold. Ours isn't very strong. Why like a super glue one? Yeah. To stay there for five years. Spiffy. Can you Let's see? <laughs> Can you brush your teeth now? Yeah.
just walking Chris to school now and we left like a few minutes late, but whatever. Almost there, just like 10 more minutes. Okay, so we just walked uh, Chris and dropped him off. That was like a mile and a half, and now we're gonna walk home. Sorry, there's a big truck right here, so it's kind of loud, but um, yeah, so we're just gonna walk back now, and I'm gonna try to do it fast because I really need to be. Okay, so we literally just got home, and I'm sweating really hard. It was three miles, and it was definitely hotter on the way home than it was there. Um, and yeah, I wasn't expecting it to be that hot and Thor was still inside of his pajamas and Esme was in pants and I'm in leggings and we're all just kind of hot right now. So I'm about to turn on the air. I'm logging into Esme's Disney Plus for her and uh, we're probably just gonna sit down for a minute so that I could cool off. And, um, and then I have to fold some laundry and clean the living room. I'm probably going to clean the living room first though, because it's pretty dirty. Pretty dirty? Yep, it's pretty dirty. Okay, so instead of sitting down and relaxing for a minute, I actually showered really fast because I just felt gross and I knew if I sat down then I wasn't want to, I wouldn't want to get back up. So... Kids are eating popsicles right now. Backwards. <laughs> well, she held that upside down on accident, but <laughs> they're trying to eat their popsicles. Um, I'll, I'll clean it up in a second. <laughs> but um, yeah, they're going to eat popsicles and um, I'm going to start cleaning the living room in a second because... It's really dirty. Well, it's just messy. I normally pick it up at nighttime, and this is what it looks like when I don't pick it up at nighttime the next day. So this is like starting to be two days worth of toys played with. I'll help? Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna do that really fast. Okay, so I cleaned up some of the living room and I mean, I was probably only cleaning for like 30 minutes, but I made progress. I mean, it's not the best, but I need to make lunch right now. Okay, so I put the rest of the toys in a big pile and now he's literally just destroying my pile. So that's cool, <laughs> but I'm gonna make lunch now. Okay, so it's 12.30 and we're finally eating lunch, and um, I made myself a bagel sandwich. There's a bagel sandwich with cucumber, lots and lots of spinach, like a bagel handful, some tomatoes, and um, turkey and salami. And then I have some mandarin oranges and some strawberries. The kids are having some cucumber turkey sandwich. Tomato, string cheese, and orange. Yeah, I love orange. Oh, and then their cucumbers have um, chili powder on them. Chili? What? Chili powder? It's the red stuff that you like me putting on it, babe. Well. The spicy stuff? On your well. cucumber? Well. It's good, huh? Yeah. Mmm. He gets just a little bit too, not too much, but he likes it. He asks for it, so. I'm just spit out. <laughs> he um, is kind of going through a phase where he'll put food in his mouth, chew it up just a little bit, spit it out, and then he'll finish eating it after it's like out of his mouth. It's kind of weird, but 
All right, so I'm going to eat finally because I'm starving. Okay, so finished my sandwich. Thor ate all of my oranges. I have some strawberries left that I haven't eaten yet. And the kids were done, so I cleaned them off and they're in the living room now, but he ate pretty good. There's not much on the floor. And Esme ate decent. She basically just ate the inside of the tomato and left the skin and then she like shredded up her cheese and left it. But otherwise she ate like the rest of the food, which is good. And I just have my strawberries left. We really want to eat those oranges because they like smelt really good and they looked so juicy when I was um, like peeling them for their lunch. But yeah. They just keep eating them whenever I peel them, so maybe I'll wait until tonight to try to eat some of those when I'm like relaxing and like editing this. What are you doing, Thor? I think he just put something inside of his pull-up. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna eat my strawberry. All right, Christopher just got home from school. He's finishing some strawberries from his lunch. And then we're about to do some homework because he has some math and some reading. Thor's mad at me because I'm focusing on Christopher for a second, but he's going to be okay. How many times did you have? Um, three. Three Okay, so Thor just woke up from a small nap and a very long tantrum while I got dinner ready. We're just doing leftovers. Doing some lasagna and some more of those oranges because they're ready to eat and good. Mm -hmm. And I have leftover mm -hmm. lasagna. It doesn't look too appetizing because I just warmed it up in the microwave. And cheese kind of gets hard sometimes when you're warming stuff up in the microwave. And I use the same plate to literally warm up all their food. So that's why there's like all, it's all smudgy and everything. But I have some oranges with it. I probably won't be able to get to eat any of them because Thor is literally just eating oranges right now. And then he's going to probably ask for all of mine. But... Yeah, so I'm going to try to eat my oranges first, I think, so that he can't get to them before I do. But that's what we're doing right now. It's like 4.30, and um, I like to get the kids ready to bed at 6. So we'll eat, uh, clean up a little bit, and then just relax afterward. Okay, so I finished all my food, except for Thor ate like two of my oranges, and he ate... His orange didn't really touch his lasagna, which isn't really like him because he normally eats a lot and he's still having like a tantrum. He's really sad. So I don't know what's going on with him. He keeps saying, oh, and then he's being angry and now he's just being sad and I can't really do anything about it. So I'm just holding him, seeing if maybe he wants any more bites of food. Kids are just hanging out. It is, what time is it? It's five o'clock. So we've got an hour before bed and he's pretty grumpy. So I'm probably just gonna be hanging out for an hour. Um, maybe get together their clothes for bedtime and stuff like that. But otherwise I'm probably just gonna be holding Thor the whole time. You okay? Okay, so all the kids are asleep, which is great. I decided to try an Otter Pop for the first time in a really long time. They're made with 100% juice now. This one is lime flavored and it's pretty good. They don't have like the same colors as they used to. They're not like all colorful and stuff. They all seem to be like the same color, which I guess is good because it means that like there's not a bunch of added colorants and stuff to them but yeah this one has it's lime flavored and it has water apple juice 
sugar, natural flavors, citric acid, and sodium bentonate and potassium sorbate, which are preservatives. So, yeah, it's pretty good. But the kids are asleep. I literally just got them all into bed. Um, Garrett got home right after I put Christopher and Esme to sleep. Because I normally put them to sleep and then I rock Thor for a moment. He doesn't fall asleep when I rock him, but I just kind of cuddle with him and rock him for a moment before I lay him down. And by then the kids are calm enough for me to put Thor down with them. Um, but Garrett came home right after that, so kept Thor up for just a moment because he was excited to see his dad. And um, I just laid him down, though. I don't know if he's actually asleep yet. Like, I just laid him down, but this thing's kind of dirty. <laughs> but he's just laying down and um, falling asleep. And I got to pick up the random toys that are left over that I didn't get to pick up today, which isn't a lot compared to what was there today. I got to load the dishwasher and um, yeah, I have like three baskets of laundry inside of my room that I need to get done and I'm really dreading it because I'm tired. Like taking care of three kids and being pregnant and then walking like the three miles today, it, I don't know, it just gets tiring, you know? So by the end of the day, I'm pretty pooped, but like just finishing cleaning up this and then doing the kitchen, I'm gonna be exhausted afterwards. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hurry up and try to do this stuff after I finish my popsicle, because popsicles are more important. And um, then I think I'm going to get ready for bed um, and relax with an audiobook while I fold my laundry because I tend to be more productive when um yeah when I'm listening to audiobooks and stuff like that so I'm going to do that right now I'm gonna edit the vlog and um I don't know how often I'm going to be vlogging I really like doing it and I would definitely do it every day if I could so We'll see. I think it kind of just depends on the mood of myself and the kids and what's going on in that day. I'm also vlogging on my phone, um, which hopefully works out a little bit better this time because I have a newer phone and it has a lot more storage space so I could actually record more during the daytime. But my laptop is a Chromebook and I have no idea how to freaking get a video editing app on there. Last time I had a Microsoft and I would just use like the movie maker that they had on it to edit my videos, but I have not been able to get a single thing on that computer that works properly. Like it just doesn't. So I'm going to have to try to figure out how to edit on my phone. So if it looks crappy, that's why. But bye guys. I'll talk to you later.